let me talk about something. I find it interesting in, in the news, I believe it speaks about how many people that died from that illness, if you know what I am talking about. Let me call it Coroni. Coroni. How many babies die in abortions? Isn't that a loss of life as well? What is the point in displaying how many people died from Coroni if there are laws allowing people to abort, abort their babies, kill their babies. I don't really understand it. You care about the deaths of Coroni, but do you care about the deaths of abortions, of babies dying from people choosing to kill their baby. How can you say that you care so much about people dying from Coroni if you are accepting, if you are not against abortions? Is it possible, and I believe God is allowing Coroni to do what it is doing, is it possible God is allowing Coroni because of, let's say, one of the reasons is abortions? Is it possible that one of the reasons God is allowing Coroni is because of abortions? If you kill a baby, that is a loss of life. So how can you care so less about a death of a baby and care more about something that is killing people, I guess, from Coroni? Makes no sense to me. If we sin and if we are warned to stop and if we continue to sin, what do you believe is going to happen? I believe this Corona stuff and you may disagree with me. I believe this Corona stuff is a blessing in disguise because I believe it is waking up some people. And you may say to me, Kevin, Uncle Kev, call me Uncle Kev, what do you believe I should, we should do? If you haven't, give your life to Jesus Christ immediately. We don't know when we are going to die. I believe tomorrow is not promised. I don't think God promised any of us that we are going to live tomorrow. So whether you die of Corona or die of whatever, I guess anything is a possibility, or most things maybe. What you should be concerned about, I believe, is dying 
without Jesus Christ dying in sin. Yes, you can die in a car crash. You can die of Corona. You can die of this and that, but I believe dying in sin is something that people should be more concerned about if they aren't. So let me stop here. I pray this all makes sense to you. Let me stop here. God bless you.